Here is a painting that I am going to sand off and redo. So ha I'm going to have so much fun. Okay. I have this painting that I'm going to sand. And I just wanted to demo how I do it. I do it with a little mouse sander. I've got grit on here that's uh, coarse, just because this is pretty thick. And so I'm going to, you know, I just love this thing. It's, it's good for the hand. I just, it's comfortable. So that's why, and I'm going to turn this on and see if it'll be too loud for you. Because, it, oh, it's going to be loud. So I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this, but without the sound. So. That, that way it's not going to hurt your ears. So give me a minute. As you can see, <clears throat> excuse me, I am, tr I am really sanding. I've got my mask on and so forth to keep away the dust. But I'm going over this and it's not working like it normally does. I'm having to really put down some effort. And that's not the normal way. I usually have paint left. I can leave some. And, and remove some and so forth. And I'm going really close. And this is when I discover this isn't wood. This is a something underneath. I am, I'm, uh, I'm kind of like, okay, this is a really old painting. So I don't have any idea what I've done. This was so many years ago. I just keep going and keep going and keep going. And it's like, okay, guys, this is not going to work. I could tell you that right now. I am, I am baffled by this. This is going to take quite a long time of sanding because this is very thick. And so I will show it to you afterwards. And I, I have collage on here. I have, uh, I have lots of things on here, I think. And so it's going to take a while to get it down. I want to leave some of the color and get rid of a lot of the color because I want to redo this entire painting. And in order to do that, I don't want this all on here. So I'll show you when this is done. So we'll see if it works. I mean, I don't know. I do others, but this one is particularly thick. Now this is on a, a cradle board that I had made. It's a 48 by 48. So anyway, I will we'll see if this is going to work and I'll show you too when we're done. Thanks. Okay, guys. After I started uh, sanding, I realized that this had a really thick coat underneath it. And look what I can do. I'm going to remove this because if it's this fragile, I do not want it on here. And I'll just have a brand new, brand new piece of, uh, I mean, of cradle board. I cannot get over that. Look at this. I guess I could use it in collage, couldn't I? But some of it may or may not come off as well as others, but I'm just amazed at how easy this is peeling up. And uh, I do, this is an old painting, so I don't know what I had put on there in order to, um, yeah, I should just frame that just for fun. I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's just a nice shape, so it makes it it makes it really really nice. But anyway, I just thought you'd want to see this because it's so unusual. So I will um, show you the new painting as it's going along, because this just like just like a garden, we have to adjust, move things around, and I just think it's fascinating. So anyway, I'll talk to you later. Just thought you'd want to see it.